Princess Casserole here and I am here with a hopefully another educational video and this is a video about different types of clips. So I'm going to go over a few different examples and hopefully this will be a bit educational for you guys and you can ask any questions you want in the comments below. Hopefully I can answer them. If not, hopefully. I know somebody else will be able to answer them because we have just a great group here. So the first thing I want to go over, and this is the only example I have of them, is a fur clip. Now fur clips have really long prongs. They're spring spring loaded like that. They're really like the clothes and uh and be nice and tight once they close. But they have two sets of really long prongs to dig into the fur, and that is what they look like. So, nice, long prongs. This is a fur clip. Now, these, are an example of dress clips. These are pot metal. I think they're really cool. I love these guys. Um, Smart Renard. And they do have little prongs. This will not mess your dress up. It'll just keep it in place. And these were often worn together, or you can also have kind of worn it just one of them as well, but these are dress clips. I know sometimes people have questions because they think, oh, well, it's got these, these prongs on there. They would mess up your dresses, but they, they do not. So it'll just keep them in place, and these are dress clips. I have a couple examples of them. These look a little bit different, but they also have the little prongs and they are little grapes. Thought these ones were cute. And this one is a fancier one. Again, similar. And these are, you can wear these by themselves too, if you, especially if you have a V, you know. Um, same thing with this one. So there's different shapes and styles, as you can tell, of what they look like. But this is also a dress clip. Now this is called a duet clip. Um, I believe it was Trifari who made a lot of these. This is not Trifari. <laughs> um, does say patent pending on there as well. But these can usually come together and be a brooch like this. Or you can take them apart. And they're also dress clips with the little prongs again. So they're a little bit more dynamic because they could be either a brooch or dress clips. And again, you can wear them alone or together. These ones look like little snails. Pretty cool. Now we have shoe clips. Shoe clips normally look like this. They also have little prongs. These are little furry ones. Um, I have these ones. These are interesting because they have separate ones. And I think these ones are called Tiptoe. I think these are super cool. They're really 60s and I kind of super love those. Those are shoe clips. These are shoe clips. These are my favorite shoe clips that I have found. The little 
little prongs there. So these are all shoe clips. Um, we also have scarf clips. These don't have any little prongs at all. And those ones are scarf clips. And then we also have sweater clips or sweater guards. And those look like this. I also have a whole video if you look in my history or do a search on my sweater clip collection. Um, I love those very much. I have very many <laughs> collections of sweater clips. Now, the next one is not actually um, either one of those. <laughs> so this is Hillcraft jewelry. I need to do a video on these specifically in this company. It's got a very interesting history. Um, these I think are super cool. It's still got the Hillcraft thing on them, how much money it was with even the tax on it. They're all gold filled. They look like this. And I promise you, you're probably not going to believe me because a lot of people don't, but these are neither shoe clips nor dress clips. These are actually earrings. So I will do another video to show you how these go on your ear. It is odd. <laughs> and I have not worn them, worn them for a whole day, but these seem to cause a lot of questions, these Hillcraft um, earrings. They are neither shoe clips nor, nor anything of the sort. They are actually earrings. Um, shouldn't probably be in this video, but I know I get a lot of questions on what the heck are these um, when people find them, and then they don't seem to believe me when I give them the answers. So, fur clips, duets, dress clips. I will show you guys the back because that is the easiest to see. Shoe clips. and the um, scarf clips. So if you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you enjoyed this video and want more content like this, please give me a like and share it as well if you think this might be helpful to people because based on the questions that I see on Facebook, I think it might be. So I will see you guys in my next video. And if you, you're not subscribed, please subscribe, do all the things, and again, see you, see you next time. Bye, guys!